I'm very, very hungry. I have not eaten since yesterday about maybe about 4.45 p.m. because I think it's super healthy to skip dinner or supper as some people call it and because we do not need those calories and that food energy while we're resting and sleeping. You just don't need it. It's just going to add pounds to you. So once you get used to it, it's okay. Now, now yes, I do feel like I want food. Not real true hunger, but I definitely want food, um, you know, when it's getting close to bedtime. And, you know, let's say I'll go to sleep at 8.30 and I haven't eaten since about 5 p.m. Yeah, but I'll suffer through it. And I'll keep telling myself that, well, you know, I'll maintain my weight this way or maybe I'll even weigh uh, a few ounces less. And it's working. Um, I'm on a very good uh, maintenance diet like this. And um, the thing is, I'm very hungry now in the morning. I still haven't eaten and it's what, it's 9 a.m. because I wanted to get these videos done. You know, there are people who say they can't eat breakfast, they're not hungry in the morning. Well, of course not. You know, if they're eating all, all hours of the night, especially very fatty foods, very filling foods. So uh, it's a very good thing to try. Of course, you can't do this if you have some kind of blood glucose problem like hypoglycemia or hyperglycemia which is low blood sugar or high blood sugar, diabetes. But you can certainly, uh, <coughs> excuse me, that's the correct way to cough, by the way. Not like that. <coughs> can, can you imagine they used to tell people to, to greet each other with their elbow and we're coughing in our elbows? <laughs> anyway, back to not, not eating dinner. Um, so I plan to eat in a little while and um, remember true hunger is in the back of your throat it's not in your mouth it's not in your mind so uh, try it and uh, it works for me and I love food just like anybody else especially since I have part Italian heritage we love food think about it 